Hello everyone! Sometimes it seems like the pilots of airplanes and helicopters have nerves of steel. Just for you, we've prepared only the most spectacular and mind-blowing videos from the world of aviation. Let's get it on. Expert Pilot How did he manage to stay calm in this situation? Well, on his Instagram account, the man admits that he has more than 20,000 flight hours. Such mad skills are gained only through practice and hard work. Please tell me that I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah. Please tell me all the bad, never good, fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah. Please say any negative thoughts, I pop off when I hear people say I cannot. I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong, I won't stop to the top, so you better back off again, boss. Air shows in the United Arab Emirates are just as fascinating as their fountains and architecture. Turns out, not only people can feel emotionally exhausted. The only downside of sitting by the airplane window. It's much more pleasant to watch it from the ground, right? Taking off from an aircraft carrier is a form of art. These guys seem to have no idea what social distancing is. This mystery has a simple explanation. The frame rate matches the rotation rate of the blades. if you stick your head out of an airplane flying at 130 miles per hour. At least a couple of your wrinkles will be smoothed out. What could be more unexpected than hearing man overboard on an airplane? By the way, if you stick your head out of the helicopter, your wrinkles will smooth out even more. Taking off from an aircraft carrier is challenging enough, but can you imagine what it's like to land a helicopter on the deck of a cruiser right in the middle of a storm? The 
pilot must be a true descendant of Thor, since he managed to handle the rage of the elements. This helicopter just wanted to help someone. In the end, it was the one who needed help. Nothing can scare you when you have a co-pilot like that. Seems like the takeoff of this helicopter didn't go according to plan. Check out how brave this girl is. The pilot's skills deserve applause as well. The way he stabilized the plane is impressive. Isn't this guy a superhero? Such devices are used to lift workers up to the power lines. They work at very high altitudes. Sometimes pilots have a burnout at work and they really need to cool off a bit. And they say that Pegasus is a fictional creature. They also say that roosters can't fly, but now we know the truth. Remember those red monkeys from Toy Story? You gotta admit, that is a good cosplay. Still pretty fun. Man, this is easy. Wow, it's pretty high up here. You must have heard stories about planes making emergency landings right on a highway. This small aircraft had to land on the road because it ran out of fuel. But local services promptly helped with the refueling, stopped traffic nearby, and allowed the plane to take off again. When you've been wanting to learn how to fly since you were a kid, but you also love physics very much. If you still haven't hit that like button and subscribed, this is a good moment to show us your love. It doesn't look that hard when you watch it sitting on your couch. But actually, the stunt is quite dangerous. The water flow creates air currents, which could disorient the pilot. 
you need to be a real pro not to lose control of the helicopter. It's a pity such a trick only works with small aircraft like the Cessna 185. One can hardly do this with a Boeing. In order to experience weightlessness, you don't actually have to go to space. An experienced pilot can easily create zero gravity in an airplane. For example, if they follow the so-called Kepler curve. <laughs> Well, this entertainment is not for everyone. Some get really sick due to the lack of experience. Seems like the videos with people who forget about handbrakes have reached a whole new level. Oh, Why isn't this cutie in a pet carrier? There's probably no way that you can put a falcon in a carrier. This bird is too proud. By the way, if you ever fly Qatar Airlines, be ready to see a neighbor like that. This is an aircraft emergency turbine, a device that pops out when AC power in an aircraft fails. As you can see, it comes out from a special compartment. While some aircraft have two of them, others don't have even one. This helicopter came to rescue a tourist who sprained her leg while hiking on a cliff in Rio de Janeiro. That's some efficient help if I've ever seen one. <laughs> this is what flying at supersonic speed looks like. The pilot of this plane is probably a fan of the flight movie. Sometimes when pilots look up, they see more than just the sky. Some pilots are so skillful that they can land a plane even without a landing gear. Putting out forest fires from a helicopter is another difficult challenge not everyone is up to.
a game changer in aviation and agricultural technology. But enough about pilots, the skills of flight attendants are no less amazing. Before flying huge planes, you should really practice on smaller ones. Otherwise, you risk ending up in a situation like that. The important thing is not to try recreating the miracle on the Hudson when you fly a biplane. This is how NASA simulates a hard landing of an airplane. They also do similar testing with helicopters. Oh wow, that was rough. But everyone is safe, and this is the most important thing. Air refueling is one of the most difficult tasks in aviation, and only the coolest pilots are up to the challenge. Accuracy and careful planning are crucial here. But sometimes, even the best pilots have bad days. Here are some cool shots of first-class pilots doing aerobatics right in the Alps. You can watch this endlessly. Do you think ponies would pass as hand luggage? Recline your seats and unfasten the seatbelt. Don't forget to give us a like if you enjoyed our flight, and see you soon.